Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Fire Red. Now, uh, before you take any more steps, make sure your, uh, your Pokemon are completely healed, because right up here, we're gonna face our rival, Bonjour. You caught 40 types of Pokemon. I don't think we've even seen 40 types of wild Pokemon yet. This guy's so crazy. He doesn't know what he's talking about. He only has 5 Pokemon on his team. How's he caught 40? Whatever. Alright, so his first Pokemon is a Pidgeotto, which is a uh, flying type. So, a uh, a rock type, but then an electric type, or an ice type, if you even have that yet, will uh, do the trick. And since I have Pikachu, it won't be a problem at all. But Thundershock's a weak attack, so it took two, sh two shots to kill it, but it really isn't that hard to take on. Alright, level 21. I saw Eradicate. I'm scared. All, all the Eradicates always kill my Pokemon. All the Rattata and Eradicates. And they always kill my Mankey. Like, every time the Rattata kills my Mankey. But this time's gonna be different. I can feel it. Now I have Brick Break. So that's good. Wow, it actually didn't use an attacking move, so I actually might kill it. Yes, I killed Eradicate. This is like the first time this whole game that Mankey hasn't died from Eradicate. Alright, Kadabra. In my opinion, this is his hardest Pokemon. Just because it's really fast and confusion. Oh, I forgot that it was strong against fighting types, but it it'll kill a lot of Pokemon pretty fast. Its defenses are pretty bad, though, so... It shouldn't be that hard to kill, as long as you can survive an attack. I don't know how much Metal Claw will actually do, but I'll try it, because I'm pretty sure it's my strongest attack. I really don't know. And a critical hit, that's great. Oh wow, that barely did anything. And he's probably going to kill me now. I probably should have just uh, used uh, Bowser first, but... That's not a problem. I'll get him this time. It'll be super effective, but hopefully he doesn't kill me. Yeah, I did about half, so that's fine. I, I know- Oh, great. No. Not confusion. Please hit, please hit. Yes. Well, this will definitely take care of it, because it has really bad defenses. So... Alright, it's War Tor Torval. Now, uh, whatever starter you picked, he'll pick the opposite type. And it'll be at level 20, and it'll be at the second form of the evolution, obviously. So, uh, if you have, if you're fighting War Torval like me, any Grass type or Electric type will do the most damage. And he's using Withdraw, with, which won't help him because I'm using a special attack. It has really good defense, though, <coughs> though so, oh, nice critical hit. But other than that, it has really good defense and, oh, nice one hit point. But I got lucky with that critical hit, but even if I died, Bowser would have been able to take care of it. So there we go, we've beat our rival, so that's good. <laughs> At least you're racing your Pokemon. Yes, I am. Okay, so he's talking about a Cutmaster on board. It's a seasick old man. So he's telling me to go see him, so that's what we're gonna do. So he's up here. It's a captain's room, he has a town map on the wall. I don't know why I clicked on that. I just wanted to see what it was. And if you look in the in the trash, it'll say, yuck, shouldn't have looked. So, oh, I feel hideous. Erp, seasick. So, you just rub his back. Rub, 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 rub. And he magically feels better. better. So, uh, he gives you the HM for cut, which is HM01. Now, if you don't know what an HM is, it's uh, a move that you can teach your Pokemon they can use outside of battle, but the pro it, it never runs out, that's the good thing. Like a TM, it runs out, but an HM never runs out. But the problem is, you can't take it away from any Pokemon, except unless you go to a move deleter. So that's why I, I bought Oddish. I am bought, caught Oddish, and so I could have a Pokemon that's used just for cut. I'll probably teach it Flash too, once I, do, once I get that move. So, uh, now we can leave the ship. So, just head out the door. And oh my god, the ship is leaving! No, come back! I want to get back on! 
You're leaving without me. Come back. So, I heal your seasickness and this is how you repay me? You leave without me? Stupid captain. I saved your life. Yeah, but anyway. The second you leave, it'll, it'll uh, leave the docks and you won't be able to go back. So make sure you do everything you want to get, do there. Like, the, really the main thing you'd want to get in there is a TM for Brick Break. That's really the only good mo good item in there. So, but anyway, after you leave it, it'll go away and... Um, and it will... You, you won't be able to go back, so just make sure you do everything. I went into the mart and just sold that Stardust I got, along with that Nugget I got at the Nugget Bridge that I never sold. So I got some uh, money there. But anyway, we're in the... Ver Vermilion? Yeah, we're in Verm Vermilion City Gym. And it is an electric type gym. And this is, in my opinion, like the worst gym puzzle out of any of the uh, Pokemon games. Mainly because it's belt dealt mainly on luck. Or actually, all on luck. But before we get into that, let me uh, go ahead and fight all these trainers. So, the first guy is a Pikachu. So, uh... I'll, it'll probably get it in one hit, but the problem is Pikachu's uh, a lot faster than Mankey. But it has bad defense, so it'll probably die in one hit. Yep. Aw, oh, paralyzed, great. Alright, so... He has another Pikachu. Dwayne. I've never met a white guy named Dwayne. But whatever. Aw, oh, slam again. I'm almost dead. But... I'll be able to at least beat this guy. Wait, what? He has one hit point left, are you serious? Oh my god, last time I killed him and it was the exact same level. I think. <laughs> oh, that's that sucks, but whatever. I'll go ahead and send out Charmeleon. Wow, my Charmeleon is still level 20, I'm surprised. I haven't used it like at all lately. But anyway, this Pikachu's using double team, which... That's, that's fun, but whatever, I killed it, so... We beat this guy, Sailor Dwayne. Wow, surprised me. So we got some money and... Oh, yeah, I'll put... Well, yeah, Charmeleon's already in front, so that's fine. So this guy... He's a lightweight, but he's good with electricity. Okay, whatever. He's a... Uh, engineer. Bailey? Isn't that a, guy, a, a girl's name? Are you serious? I never, I never met a guy named Bailey. I know a chick named Bailey, but... I wish I know a few chicks named Bailey, but that's not the point. Uh, okay, so... Uh, oh, critical hit, nice. So, Sonic Boom always does 20 hit points no matter what level uh, either Pokemon is, so just watch out for that. And level 21, that's cool, I guess. And he has a Magnemite, which... In the... Uh, in, in these games, Magnemite uh, inherited the Steel type, so uh, Fire types would be super effective against it, along with Ground types. I still don't know about Ground, because Magnemite might have Levitate, I'm not sure though. <coughs> but yeah, just use Fire, that's your best bet. But it's really not that hard anyway. So this is the last guy. He's talking about L Lieutenant Surge, which is his uh, drill master in the army, and Lieutenant Surge is the gym leader, if you didn't know. And this guy has a Pikachu, that's great. Level 23. <laughs> all these Pokemon are stronger than mine. But, I can still beat them all. Because they're weak. So, slam. Alright, so this will probably take care of it. Alright. And, uh, after, after this guy, you've beaten all the trainers in here except the gym leader. So, uh, next time I'm going to show you how to beat this puzzle. Uh, yeah, it, it really sucks. I'll see you next time. Bye.